Yo, 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 it's your boy, the insurance junkie, your fiduciary fella, the all-star advisor of Alonzo Hall, and I've returned today with another ADH Wealth Solution. Today, we'll begin to discuss fulfilling all of your financial needs. To contribute to channel growth, the links are in the description. To schedule an appointment of your own, or to purchase life insurance directly up to $1 million with no medical exam and an instant decision, my information is in the description. Lastly, make sure you hit that like, drop a comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you're made aware every time I release new content. And as always, share, share, share. And now, here's our next feature. Salute, folks. It's your boy, the insurance junkie, your fiduciary fella, the all-star advisor of Alonzo Hall, and I've returned today to whap and tap on your head with another ADH Wealth Solution. Today, I want to talk about ethics or professionals doing the right thing. But before I go in, ladies and gentlemen, make sure you hit the like, drop a comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you're made aware every time I release new content. And as always, share, share, share. Lastly, to contribute to channel growth or to schedule a one-on-one -on -one appointment with a licensed financial professional, the links are in the description. So, most financial companies today have embraced and are teaching their sales reps how to act ethically in selling insurance and other financial products. In addition, the terms compliance and market conduct now play a central role in virtually all financial sales activities. Now. Because these terms are in such heavy use today, it's important to understand the distinctions between them. So, let's get started with compliance. It means conducting business in accordance with current rules and laws that are set by government authorities and the courts. So, it means to be following the rules and making sure that life insurance producers and companies go by the book when they're conducting business. The laws and regulations set the minimum standards by which producers are expected to behave. So the laws and regulations, they tell us what we must do. So now let's move on to ethics. And ethics are standards of conduct and moral judgment. Ethics is the moral framework within which decisions are made. Ethics involves doing the right things the right way for the right reasons. Ethics are about what we should do. So codes of ethics identify and encourage desirable activities by formally establishing a high standard against which individuals may measure their behavior. So characteristics of an ethical insurance producer are honesty, integrity, loyalty, fairness, compassion, respect for others, personal responsibility and accountability, and now, lastly but not leastly, we're going to talk about market conduct. So this is a combination of both ethics and compliance. And it refers to how insurance companies and producers conduct themselves in accordance with ethical standards and in compliance with rules and laws governing insurance policy sales, marketing, and underwriting. Practices as well as policy issuance, service, complaints, and even terminations. Market conduct is synonymous with behavior, with professional behavior. The ethical insurance producer knows and acts in accordance with ethical principles, as well as in compliance with rules and laws governing the sales and servicing of insurance policies. So basically, ethical behavior helps financial professionals to gain professional satisfaction and the respect and loyalty of their clients. Bottom line, good ethics is good business because good clients usually refer other good clients to ethical producers. However, don't define your success solely on financial gain, but also by serving insurers and the general public. That's going to be it for today, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure you hit the like, drop a comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you're made aware every time I release new content. And as always, share, share, share. With that being said, wipe ass. Work in progress every day and see success. Salute, salute, salute. Hey folks, 
This last video was sponsored by my company, where we help people like you to reach their financial goals. We do this through a simple conversation where we help to identify and then protect your lifestyle. And then we implement a plan. The process starts at about an hour. So if you want more information or you want to schedule a consult, contact me via the information in the description box. And let's talk and see if we're actually a great fit for each other. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, when people challenge you, they don't challenge you to challenge you, but they challenge you to challenge you. Accept the challenge. Thank you and enjoy life.